Hey Stampers, Gator again, and I'm coming back with that beautiful card kit you saw me on the first of October. October. I had this delivered with my order. So I prepped quite a lot. I'm only going to do one of each of the cards to show you, and then I might come back and do another video doing alternate cards. Uh, this is just the cutest little card I've ever seen. I mean, what? Let's guess the size of these as well. So that is two inches by three and a half. How cute. So we're gonna keep our cards with our envelopes. And then we've got, obviously got our note card, which normally is, oh, it's two and a half by four and a half. Ooh, cute. I should do these in order because I'm going to spin them back round and then we've got this one which measures four by three and a half and that goes with that envelope and then we've got two that are both the same size uh, have I got their envelopes out but it doesn't look I thought I had oh I thought I had I'll get them out now and these measure five and a half by four and a quarter. So they're standard size cards. I got my dimensionals out. I've already stamped all the sentiments to save on a little time, but because we still got to color all these wonderful cards in as well. So let's get... There they are. There's two envelopes. Pop my stamp. I'm not using the pencils, I'm going to use the blends. It's going to be quicker for one. So, there are our cards in order. Now, let's start with the first one. Tiny, tiny, tiny. And it is this tiny little one here. So, let's. Whoops, I've got all. We're looking for this one. How cute is that? So I think they're all on dimensionals. I'm not sure. I'm going to glue some down as well. So we're going to prep all these bits first. One of the large ones. So that's that one, but that was a large. That gets glued on there with a strip of this over there as well. Prep, 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 prep. strip make sure that's nice and straight oh that's good so that's with a large envelope because we've got a, so it's that one first then that one then the hexagonal one which is going to be the whole of this bit weird that's a bit weird isn't it huh oh that's a weird isn't it? so I'll pop that on there anyway You'd have thought that would have opened that way, wouldn't you? Let's just make sure. Oh, that's it. And it's a little bit on the bias. 
mean, no one's going to see that actually. Anyway, so. Oh, unless they've got that card opening like that. But that's a weird one. But, weird, 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 weird. But that one's for that one. And the next one is this and the white. That's getting laid up on there. round, leavening. Oh, have I missed a bit? No, that's for that one. So that bit is going down there on that one. We've got our vellum leaves. ready first and that's going on there I love that crumb cake colour with that black and white stripe looks lovely that one and this one that was there so the envelopes are all prepped I can't put the labels on till later so we're going to need to pop that back in there just for a moment Oh, wait there now. Gold, ah, it goes on that. Is that the gold one? Okay, let's stop. Nails. Right, gold goes through there and on that one as well. So these are for after, so we're okay for a moment. We've basically just got colour stuff in now. Here it is. So let's pop these to one side. I've got another battery ready to go, but let's get, and these, the, well, the colors were Blackberry Bliss, and I've chosen all the light ones. Sorry, Rich Razzleberry, Flirty Flamingo, all, Old Olive, and Granny Apple Green. So it required us to color, and not with that end of the pen. Let me zoom you in. Because they were the pencil colours. I'm using these. The others were pencils and would have taken ages. So, granny apple green for the leaves, and the dark old olive is for the shading. And it says on the instructions, use the lighter colours first, and then go over with the darker. Cute. So this is just for the centres. So I'm just going to dot. that quite nice together actually. So let's do all our leaves first. That's done. Rummage around these leaves in no time. it like a conveyor belt you could probably sit there one night and color all these all of the flowers in and the leaves and then separate all the bits the following night and then attach everything together the following night after doing all the stamping you could just do it in sections like that that would be nice wouldn't it beautiful 
beautiful. Mind you, let's do the dark while we're here. I don't want to be forgetting anything. Lovely. Excuse me about the sniffling. See, I might grab the dark of the old olive actually. Yeah, I think I will. It stands out a little bit better. Watch. Sniffle skills. Beautiful. I might just go under the bud there. Perfect. Just do those little flowers. How sweet. Oh, let me have a look at this one. Ah, right. There's lots of leaves on this one, so. Move you in. doing these card kits but I'd like to do an alternative as well you know maybe add different design of those paper that new leaf forever ferns would look nice on this wouldn't that be lovely breed gainer there goes my battery. Wow, that went quick. So let me grab a fresh battery. Just give that chance to come on while I put this on charge. Wow, that didn't last long at all. Give the old conker a wipe there. Beautiful. Let's go in with the dark. Perfect. Coming along lovely. back yeah do you want you could do it like I'm saying if you've got an hour here spare you could do all the colouring and then if you've got another hour spare maybe stamp all the sentiments then another hour spare mind you I reckon you'd get this pretty much done once all the colouring's done I reckon you'd get fly through this because the stamping of the sentiments doesn't take much. One, two, three, four of each. And if you are a person that needs, oh, that one's got no leaves on. Oh, that's cool. So, 
I've finished with our leaf apart from the dark. There we go. Now we can set to colour in those beautiful flowers. And wow, this is going to be a task and a half. Just all the tips. So I'm just dotting. Larger ones I'm doing a little bit more. The other ones, oops, sticking to me. Sorry about the sniffles they did. No one likes a sniveller. Just spot another leaf in there, but I might get away with that. Wow. Oh, blimey, there's a lot of pink on this. And then we're going to go over the dark as well. That is cute, though, really cute. I'm holding my breath, that's what it is. I shouldn't hold my breath. When I'm in deep thought, I do. So yeah, I'm just gonna cheat. Dash, dash. I'm just making sure I've got a bit of color on there before I go in with the dark. Oh, now put the light where it's dark, so to say. Just gonna uh, dot them as well. Take uh, this would take you the longest. It looks lovely though together. Look at that. Who would have thought of pairing these two colours up? Nice. I could do that again there. Eh? That looks really nice. I'll come closer in a minute. And they're just as nice as what they are in the box. Very small though, these little things.
Kane is holding her breath again. I'm thinking if I don't breathe, my nose won't run. <laughs> it's just that time of year when the heating goes on. Oh, the dry air. That's lovely. I'm gonna hold that up and show you. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. So that's the hardest bit done. Right now it's these beautiful. Larger berries. I've done an alternative when you think about it straight away. By not using pencils, I'm going to leave that open because I'm going to come back to that. Because I'm going to blend that in. bottom of every bit. I've only got one more after that, then we can start to build them up. Maybe I should have had those ones done already. Two more to do. Perfect, that's so cute. So Now 
I'll see still. to our last little bit and we're just gonna I'm just gonna go around each of the petals to, to darken this one. are going funny again now. Lovely. Now I'm leaving it at that. Yay. So let's get assembling. I want my I've got my bell and flowers. There's ten of those. swig of coffee. Right, let's start off with that little one there. So it needs that one to be on dimensionals. I was buying these ones from the kits a lot thicker than the ones we buy. Uh, What we haven't done. We haven't done that. I'm gonna glue those two together. And then that's going on dimensionals as well. Don't want to come off these. Let me zoom back out just a little bit. Oh, blimey, these don't want to come off. There we go, that one did. Right, I need two vellum leaves. see that. I'm going to need a little bit of this ribbon. Why did they do that? Put it in plastic, plastic, plastic. Too much plastic. Oh my. 
better. Uh, I think that was done. Oh no, the sentiment. show you more at the end and then this one is the here for you Do a curling irons, uh, straighteners. I don't own straighteners, so otherwise I could cut that down to size. fingers. Perfect. And we need two leaves for this one. We need four actually. So one. one and this one. I'm just going to glue that one down. Does that need? Nope. And then I pop this on dimensionals. gems. Always here for you, sat on start, working nine to five. I'm going to do the hectagonal one last because, of, look, I forgot to colour it in. <laughs> on there if you're going to hide it. Literally going to hide it. I don't like it when they do that. I prefer it when they... Doing a gold strip. There's no... Um, green cord on this one. Uh, the sentiment is lots and lots and lots. No leaves 
on this one either. And there's that card. That is so cute. Right, this one now. There's this one. I don't know, I haven't noticed. Oh, I'll put it on upside down then. Ladies and ladies and ladies. So, what did I need? No, the leaves are for this one. So, one at the top. One at the bottom. Oh, these, oh, I don't like these dimensionals. They're giving these kits way too thick. Oh, I should have glued that one. I'm going to glue that one on the top because I've used dimensionals on the back. And there's no hole for ribbon on that one either. You deserve the best life has to offer. That is, I'm going to put some gems on on a later date, but not right this second. I've got one more card to do, and I've got to colour it in. <laughs> oh wow, and look at all those leaves. So I'm on this one, girls, I'm not offering shading. Send the flower. Ah, but the thank you is going on this, so let's do this properly. Use our heads. Ugh. Great. Let me stick that down, then I can see where it's going. You don't have to colour it all in then. Oh my goodness, come on. Oh blimey. Wow, that was hard. I've got to tuck my flowers in so I've got space so I can. should have just put these down first, shouldn't I? But it's too late now. So let's chop that down as well. In fact, I'm going to chop that whole section off there. It should be more under there, but never mind. Poking out the bottom there as well.
perfect. Now we can. Oh, now I've covered up your flowers. It's only bare one, so I can lift it up. There's all the one mark. And I want to go and do the pale pink on this one. Even my pen lasts out. Forgot about this one needing colouring in. I've stuck that light down. Oh well, can't get to that one. Two pieces of ribbon, what does it matter about that now? We're done. We're done. We've done all five of those cards. I'm gonna spread them out like I want hold them up so you can have a look. Got loads of ribbon left. So let's start with card number one, which is this one. Card number two is this tiny, tiny little one. So cute. Card number three is the hexagonal one, which is the one we just finished. Card number four is this one. And card number five is this one. Aren't they gorgeous? I love them. That is so cute. So there we have it. There's those beautiful, what's it called again? Lots of happy card kit, one of each. And then next time we'll come, I come back and do, um, we'll change the, we'll change the sentiments around. We'll change some of the, where th uh, other stuff goes. Maybe that can go over there. This can go. Uh, over here, you know, swap it around a bit, jazz it up, and add some gemstones as well. I think you definitely need a gemstone. So, look, I'll tell you what, let me grab my silver one. Where's my pokey tool? There it is. Let's just go around quickly and add one, two. I didn't see any in the packet. Beautiful. 
fell. You could also add Wink Stella. One, two more, really. <laughs> One. Two. And three. Perfect, yay! We've decorated them as well. How lovely. So, Kayla's gonna do her comic one last time before. Go, go bit. So there we go, my five little cards from that beautiful lots of happy card kit. <laughs> I forget the name again, but thank you for watching. I love you all so much. I'm going to zoom out because it looks dark and it's not dark really. So till next time, take care. Love you all. Bye.